This is RTP. This is RTP 180. Thank you, Wade. Yeah. Thanks everybody for coming tonight. And uh, today I'd like to use this opportunity to tell you a little bit of, of the story of uh, the project I'm currently working on uh, at uh, G1 Therapeutics. Um, so this, uh, okay, yeah, okay, good, good. And the name of this uh, drug is uh, called Trilocyclib. It's a generic name, so so far it's harder to pronounce, but uh, very soon we will have a brand name. <laughs> yes, and uh, so I'm going to talk about uh, uh, a little bit on the chemistry and then uh, drug product formulation. Um, before that, I know people are, are always interested in knowing how does this drug work. And, uh, you know, this is not my area, but I'm trying to touch a little bit on this. And uh, as most of you are very familiar, oh, <laughs> not the same one, okay. Uh, about, the uh, about the cell growth cycle. And uh, our drug is uh, rationally designed uh, CDK4 uh, and 6 inhibitor, um, you know, uh, this is CDK4 and 6, uh, when it binds with a cycling D, uh, and then uh, it becomes active and uh, phosphorylate this uh, retinal uh, blastoma. A and then it triggers uh, the DNA uh, re replication to move from G1 to S phase. And uh, our drug, uh, when it inhibits CDK4 and 6, it uh, uh, stops the cell growth at the G1 stage. It traps the cell here. Um, when our drug is used uh, before the chemotherapeutic uh, drugs, uh, it uh, uh, has achieved uh, uh, the protection of uh, bone marrow uh, uh, system. Uh, specifically, it uh, protects uh, the hemo he hematopoietic uh, uh, stem and the uh, progenitor cells. Um, so, therefore, uh, it has uh, achieved uh, the myelopreservation. Um, in the meantime, uh, can achieve uh, uh, the efficacy to improve uh, cancer patients' overall survival. And, uh, and here, I'm showing uh, the higher level how this drug is uh, made. Um, it, it has uh, mainly four steps. Uh, if we start from the uh, regulatory starting material one, um, you know, with acid treatment, it uh, removes this uh, pro uh, protective group, bulk group, and then, you know, becomes a trial one and it then goes through an uh, oxidation step uh, here, the sulfur becomes a sulfoxide, and it becomes trialer 2, and then it couples with uh, the other starting material, starting material 2, and it's uh, uh, in presence of a base, and it then forms uh, the free base of our drug substance. And then uh, we treat it with uh, hydrochloric acid, to form the dichloride salt. The purpose to form a salt is that the salt form is uh, much more soluble. It makes it easier to formulate uh, in aqueous solution. And uh, as far as the drug product formulation, it is a, a lyophilized product uh, in order to, um, you know, to achieve the long-term stability. Um, Currently, uh, each of the vials contains a 300 milligram active drug, um, and uh, it's manufactured by a septic manufacturing process, um, and then lyophilized to achieve... Oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. <laughs> I, I wasn't worrying about it. <laughs> so, so I didn't exactly fall off the cliffs. Good. <laughs> so... Uh, <laughs> Yeah, um, so it's a sterile product, yeah. Um, and it, also in clinic, um, 
the each vial uh, before use is reconstituted by either saline or 5% dextrose. And then the reconstituted solution is added to an infusion solution bag and then get it um, uh, infused uh, into patients uh, before they receive a chemotherapeutic treatment. And we have a phase, uh, finished uh, phase two trials on small cell lung cancer and also on tri-negative breast cancer. Uh, at this point, uh, our company is planning to submit NDA uh, and the MAA next year. Uh, as, as you know, NDA is uh, for the U.S., the new drug uh, approval, uh, new drug application, and the uh, MAA is a market uh, uh, author authorization approval. Yeah. So with that, uh, I'd like to uh, s thanks my colleague, uh, Dr. Jay Strom. He's also the CSO of our company for providing um, the, the slide um, mechanism of action. I also thanks my colleague, Dr. Steven Schneider, for providing the chemistry slides. And also thanks uh, my colleague, Ms. Wendy Anders, for getting me connected with uh, RTP 180. Yeah. Thank you all again. <laughs>